Dang. It looks like a giant bug man. I don't like it. Cannot cancel it. Giant Bugman's no. here. He's here to stay. He's like, look at this ball. I am holding this ball. I have ball. You it's want shiny, ball? Shiny ball. He's shiny ball. Let's investigate to find an item real quick. Go. Find an item. There's there's a lot we still need to do. Holy cow. Sight complete. All right. Ingots in Heartwoods. The Fox Court Ring gives armor 0.5. So I guess it should go to Louie. So we have nothing. Oh Louie does not have a ring. But he's armored up. He gets more armor because he's a warrior. We're going to go to the duck wilds. Morgan, you can't come with us. Maribel comes with us. Morgan gets to stay behind. Actually, you know what? Um, Brian has to take care of his kid. Here's what I want Morgan to do. I'm going to step away for like two seconds. I need more chalky milk. Okay. BRB. Morgan's going to go over here because I'm going to have Morgan build a, build a wall. Oh God, no! She steps away to get chocolate milk. There's a there's a uh, dialogue option. Oh God, now we gotta wait. <laughs> so anyway, I was talking about the live action door of the Explorer movie earlier. And the, the midway through the movie, it completely shifts and like Dora and her schoolmates get captured and get taken to the like Amazon and then they have to and then and then like Dora has to teach him about the jungle. And, and it's it's crazy. And then there's a fox. There's like a CGI fox that is Spanish and it's Swiper and he doesn't belong. And I don't know why he's there. Because they need a Swiper. A swiper. But like everything else is like real. Everything else is real except for the CGI boots, which looks hideous and, and like a thing of nightmares. Um, But like. It's it's like a bipedal fox that talks and like nobody acknowledges that it's a bipedal fox that talks. Does he wear a little uh, uh, bandit mask? Yeah, he does. There you go. Then it's all good. It's not all good. Nobody acknowledges the anthropomorphic tiny fox that speaks Spanish. Somebody needs to say something about it. Dora and the Lost City of Gold. Yeah. I see. It's it's a it's a it's a movie. I think the reason I watched it is because my daughter and I were watching the movie. Uh, um, ah man, it's that one wrestling movie. The the um the one that has uh the animated movie that has. Um, about monsters, wrestling. I think monsters. Yeah, I think it's called Rumble. I think it's just called Rumble. It has Will Arnett in it as uh as the main character. No idea. And then after that movie, like it just for some reason automatically started playing Dora the Explorer next, and I was like, all right, whatever. I guess we're watching Dora the Explorer then. Full feature. Yeah, it was a it was a bold move. It was a bold was set. And then after that movie, it was gonna it was gonna play Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Oh my god, Liz, I are you back? So much with my kids. <laughs> Sh uh, Shark Boy was Taylor Lautner. Yeah. Did Liz come back? She's got a chocolate milk. It's all good. I got a chocolate milk. It's okay. Good. 
cool, cool. It is it, the minute you left, a dialogue option came up for you. No. <laughs> Ready? On the furthest outreaches of Duck Wilds. I'll just do one last sweep over the next ridge there and call it good. I think we've seen just about everything there is to see in this area. <sighs> Jesus. <coughs> Who goes there? Who goes there? I'm armed! Show yourself! Show your... Self? Self. <gasps> bah, bah, bah. <laughs> How did she not see that? <laughs> That's creepy. Oh no. Is she gonna get inhabited? What's happening? What exactly. the what blazes? The? <laughs> what the blazes? <laughs> That's not funny. Stop it. That's not funny. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> you guys. Who are you? What are you? Who am oh my God. I? <laughs> I'm Maribel Bixby. No, but I'm Maribel. I'm Maribel Bixby of Wherrydale. Maribel Bixby. <laughs> no, I'm Maribel Bixby of Wherrydale. You're some sort of changeling. I remember that my parents died. I broke my leg when I was seven. It was an okay life. I had this little blue blanket. But that was my blue blanket. How could you know about that? What are you doing here? I was on patrol, just doing one last sweep. I was about to call it good. You have my memories. You know my thoughts. It's like there are two of me. <laughs> oh, if you really, okay. if you really me, then maybe we can talk, talk this out. I need to get away from this now. I need to destroy it. Oh, shoot. I feel like, I feel like Maribel's curious nature would like continue to like play this out. Yeah. Until she'd go crazy and kill herself. <laughs> yeah, her I yeah, need to destroy it. <laughs> or maybe it she gets too much. Or maybe it gets bear touched. <laughs> what do you want to do? do? Think? Oh my gosh. I say be friends. <laughs> Let's try and talk this out. Okay. Something bad's gonna happen. Good. Okay Good. then, Mary Bell of Warydale. Let's take this nice and easy, huh? See, I'm putting my weapons away. Your weapons? But those are my weapons. How did you get my weapons? There are weapons, I suppose. You are me, or I'm you. Maybe both. We don't just look the same. We have the same memories. I remember my parents died, breaking my leg, the blue blanket. I know an old soldier once, crazy with a wooden leg. What was his name? Old Tria? Ha! Huh. Her name was Old Tria. Nice try. But I don't think you can trick me. <laughs> You have my memories. You know my thoughts. It's like there are two of me. God. <laughs> oh, oh my, my god. god. It's a loop now. Yes. Yes. 
It's just gonna loop. I need to destroy it. it. <laughs> no. I, gonna... Oh, keep, keep looping. Keep, keep looping. looping. Oh, was... Time loop. Okay, Maribel of Werydale, let's be friends. My thoughts exactly. <laughs> I guess that shouldn't surprise me. So now there's two of us. What do we do about it? I don't know. I'm not sure we can both go back to the others. Oh, I'm not sure we can both go back to the others. Good point. That might get a little confusing. Ah, I can. And can you imagine Louis? He would go completely nuts if there were two of us. Did we just become best friends? I think so. <laughs> hmm. I would totally be into that, by the way. <laughs> you know what I have secretly always wanted to do? Yo, wait a minute! Oh, no! No! <laughs> In the dis- Oh, oh God! <laughs> of course I do! Go back to Werydale and see if Errol will take me back! She always was the one that got away. Wow. Oh, man. Oh, no. What? That's not what you want. <laughs> but I can't leave the company. I'm needed here. I see what's is. happening now. But with yeah, two of us, one could stay with the group. While the other can take the second chance with Errol. It's perfect. Is it? Some weird sitcom bullshit. This is really weird. <laughs> this is like this the is Doctor a Who telenovela thing. that I don't want to see. It's like Doctor Who when like. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> <don't really laughs> <into> <laughs> but who does which? Oh my god. Hmm. <laughs> Draw lots? Oh god. Are you gonna have to do Maribel's voice? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and so. Oh, uh, there you are, Mirabel. We were getting uh, worried. Like, yeah. We thought you might have gotten lost. I'm, I honestly, I honestly, I just let you do it. Quite the contrary. I think you could say I found myself. <laughs> oh my god, that's where that's where the end credits play. <laughs> or or like she puts on sunglasses and it goes. Ow! Do do so do, do, do 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 do. <laughs> Oh, you. What would really be funny is if, like, they go to a different town and then and there she, she like, shows up as one of, the, <laughs> one of the people, like, helping <laughs> to defend. Yes. <laughs> I'm great. Oh, my God. Okay, wait. We need to build a station. Wait, we need... We need ingots, but we can't get ingots? Spell threads. We're gonna build this. And then... Morgan's going over here. Four shrine has been dedicated. Cool. We're gonna we're gonna go over to the sheer plane, and we're gonna scout here. Cause what I'm gonna have Morgan do, I'm gonna have him build a tunnel. Bridge. Make him build a fucking thing. He's good. He's gonna build a bridge. Cause Max isn't here, so he's gonna build a bridge. No. No, no. Great. Okay. <laughs> this something. A campfire was built here, but never burned. It's a fine fire. I don't know. Wish I'd known him better. I hope this means he's alive. But 
even if he had to leave suddenly, wouldn't he have scattered it? Maybe not, I guess. Morgan goes to make his report, perhaps more worried now than he was before. Who's he making his report to? There's no one with him. Oh, Chadwick. Chadwick. No. Chadwick. Son, Chadwick Jr. He really he has his hair. He really doesn't see it. This is good. Oh, who played Aluna? Oh, go ahead. Did we have a Did we, we have an Aluna? We before? did. I don't remember who played Aluna. Probably not me. Okay. I, I don't remember. I don't think uh, we did. Okay. And he'll never be able to. Come on, Chadwick. This place is dangerous for both of us. <laughs> oh! I'm gonna leave in a huff. Oh. Shadow? Shadows. It's a ghost. Oh, he doesn't need to build a mountain pass because there's already a uh the one that's been built here. Well, fuck. Can he clear the work? by himself? I don't know. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna assault Shearer Plane in the belly mine. That's what I call my belly button. Your belly plane. mine. <laughs> Burden of beast. Schrodinger's Mothman had passed so many abandoned homesteads as they trekked through Shearer Plain. That to see a light and a ribbon of smoke ahead was, a, was as surprising as it was welcome. House. One little haven still staked out, hmm? Hang on while they've got something like to lose. Well, let's hope they're hospitable to boot, brother. A nest. Like evening. Have to say, we weren't expecting a friendly face this close to like belly mine. Assuming you're friendly, brother. Mm. Oh. Uh, of course, I. Sorry. Come in, come in. We literally just like kind of forced our way in, didn't we? Yeah. How you do it? Normally, I'd offer you some milk or cheese, but things are <laughs> being as they are. Like, if you got a roof and a fireplace, like, already appreciative. You kept cows then, dude? Or sheep? Cow, right? Uh, cows? My livelihood. I'm surprised anyone would hang around belly mine with Gorgon corruption so close, dude. Especially a cattle farmer. Those cows were and me. We depend on each other. And just like they wouldn't abandon me, I wouldn't abandon them. Oh, too. there's a oh no. It's a it's a tainted cow. <laughs> it's a yours. <laughs> what? It's a yours. Just like never mind. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What exactly is going on here, dude? Mom? Oh? It's adorable. It's oh. so cute. I want it. <laughs> you know the sorts of questions we have to ask now, right, brother? Take you out back. Mom? Oh. 
murder. That was ready to fight. I was hoping to introduce you to the ladies and their condition a little more delicately. But long story short, I'm glad they held out until someone like you came along. Dr. Porchup. You're, you're the one to help. You have magic, don't you? And experience with, you're the ones who do the impossible. <laughs> not in the way you think, I'm afraid. Well, maybe not you. I hate to tell you this, brother, but the cow's fate was sealed a long while ago, man. They're more of a danger to you by the day, brother. And when they finally turn, it's not going to be pretty, dude. No. You couldn't at least take a look at them? <laughs> oh, they got blue on them. <laughs> One's got tentacles coming out of his ears. See if... There was something. Uh. <laughs> Tess, you've got that look, brother. That odds way and look, dude. Me <sighs> or kill them. Oh, my God. What do we do? Do we keep them or kill them? I mean... I think we'll probably have to kill them either way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Depends on if we want to study them first. Yeah. We could have an incursion with them if they change. They say we study them to know their weakness. I, I'm, oh. I'm assuming we're going to have to, like, kill them anyway. We're going to have a fight either way, I, I'm going to assume. Yeah. I say let's study them and then fight. Uh, All right. Study and then kill, I guess. All right. Yay! <laughs> oh. What happened? What? Uh, I can't see the screen. Oh. I can see it on Brick's uh, Twitch, but that's about it. That's weird. I'll read it from there. Okay. Like, think about the upside. Knowledge or better. Like, it'd be a shame to leave something that valuable on the table. As long as it's a risk you can afford to take, brother. Oh, like, take a few days and look at them. It's not like we have an official appointment time at belly mine anyway <laughs> <laughs> thank you doesn't sound like much but thank you well I'm still gonna slaughter these cows later brother <laughs> Ines put them up well and Tess appraised the cattle carefully for a few days Like, well, we know more about how the curse progresses, like, in the beast. Nothing about how it stops, unfortunately. Oh, sad times. That's something, though. Hmm. Oh, look, she's touching his butt. <laughs> oh, oh, my. She's, she's going, she's going for something other than his butt. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> he looks very surprised by it. I'm just he's reaching like, for the wallet. It's fine. He's like, well. <laughs> I have a bow and I have a sword. If you don't play with the sword, I will hit you with the bow. <laughs> <laughs> Dead. Oh, God. Dead. <laughs> it is your turn, Dr. Forjop. 
unless you had actually hoped to cure them. A savvy old Tess has broken the Gorgon menace wide open, everyone. Let's buy her around and declare a holiday. I think her <laughs> hand got closer. Oh, yeah, it has definitely gotten closer. <laughs> I like, I'm just trying to grab his money. Oh, Suddenly, I knew it. I predicted this. Huh? <laughs> Change plans, dudes. We're not going to Belly Mine anymore. <laughs> belly Mine got impatient and decided to come to us. <laughs> Crash! <laughs> They're still kind of adorable. They're so cute. I love the little cow monsters. The teeth are a little unsettling, though. <laughs> oh, no. He just wants some noms. Oh, none of the friends are here. They don't want to be left out, brother. <laughs> oh, they changed into raccoons. No, they are not raccoons. They are, they are giant cows. Uh, we don't have to fight the bug thing, but we do have to fight some cows. Cow and a cow. stagron. Oh, cow. Okay. Cow. Cow. Leave a trail for up the ground behind when it moves. Oh. Okay. Interviews. The, the raccoons kind of suck, but I mean, like. Hey. Okay. We got this. Okay. I have to wait till they come closer. Like, I don't know which which end I'm, I want to be going towards. You're going you're going towards. With the cow. You're going towards these guys. To, I wanted to interfuse with the boulder and I had to get closer. OK, I didn't want to go in the middle. All right. Well, I'm going to I'm going to stay here and kind of guard you. Someone's got to be ready to take on the cows. Interfused with two things by the cows. Okay. I don't like these big boys over here. I mean, killing the raccoon is good. That's a ranged guy. Okay. Oh, the stag lord. I don't like him. Yeah. Cause all he has to do is go and then more freaking. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, there's a there's fucking large people. Yo, he ruined the <laughs> house, dude, man. This dude was like, F this house. <laughs> he just ruined that house, man. Christ. Oh, no. No, stop it. That's enough slices. It's a lot of dude. Man. There's a That's lot of guys, slices. man. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh no. my god! Stop it! Stop One of my interfused it. objects okay. is Die. gone. Well, um, so is the house. <laughs> Get this one. Get this one. This one. Get him. I mean, I could oh, kill this. Hey. There's a cow. <laughs> no. Yeah, I I know I know what I'm doing. I made a tree! <laughs> Praise tree. Ten damage and the cow is done. So I mean the good thing is like these the, the deer don't do a lot of damage. Really annoying. Yeah. Yo, he just made one of the deer explosive. Oh boy. It is close. The house is back. Okay, cow is done. This isn't cool, brother. <laughs> this isn't cool, brother.
Okay. Okay, I'm trying to think. What what can this guy do? All right, so whoa, <laughs> I can I can kill like the row and the rager, right? I can kill the rager. I can't kill the rager. <clears throat> Yo, good shots. Oh god, oh. the the damage, the damage. Oh. They're all they're all getting pinned so they can't move. Which is really good. Okay. I'm I'm beset at all sides by deer. I made another tree. <laughs> I'm just I'm just making a lot of trees. Hold on, I'm gonna make another tree. I didn't make I didn't make a tree! Aww. Oh I'm taking Gorgon damage. Explosive. Oh it's gonna it's gonna blow up. I need to get out of there. What is what does explosive do? Hold on, let me get out of there. Can I? Here, wait, I'll get these guys. Oh, that didn't really do anything. Like, I. Can I. Kill, kill that row. Can kill I, the row. I can. It's too far away from the thing I interfused because Maribel has the other thing that's right there. Sorry. I don't have anything to interfuse to. Oh. I was hoarding it. Oh yeah. my god. I'm useless. Alright. Oh, can I attack again? I can't attack again, never mind. Um Like I can strike it, but that's about it. Yeah, just no, go ahead and it, right just it. go just go bonk, bonk it. it. I can't. Or, or go over there. Move. Okay. It was a yellow oh. move only. Ooh, block. Oh god, now he's now he's gonna explode. Yo, be careful, that thing's gonna es explode. Great. I got him. Got you. I'm in the exploding range. He dead, it's fine. Oh no, the rager. Well no, they're not gonna explode, so it's alright. We won. We won the fight. Oh my god, Maribel is like one thing away. <laughs> the gravel pelt pauldrons, 0.5 to armor. Makes anybody feel fabulous. Um, I love the description of these. <laughs> they can make any hero feel fabulous. Who wants it? Um. I already feel fabulous. <laughs> either Dungeon or Morgan. Yeah. I mean, Morgan would, would have a lot of armor at that point. Maribel actually has really low armor. Oh, okay. But she also has that thing that if angry things stand next to her, they get damaged. That's true. Okay, um, I guess I'll give it to Dungeon. <laughs> Dungeon looks good with it. Burden of Beasts. That staff is so freaking cool looking. It is a cool staff. It really is. It's like Saturn. <laughs> huh? <laughs> wow. How are you alive? A, a beast trampled through your house. <laughs> the house was rebuilt. Ha! Shutters. <laughs> <laughs> Sad. Hmm. 
Oh, okay. It didn't come through. I didn't. I didn't hear it. I've been saying stuff. Oh, I didn't hear it. No, we didn't hear it at all. <laughs> oh, sorry about your, your noise suppression. Must be like cutting it out or something. I probably. <laughs> Like, sorry about your farm. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. 